Yo, what's up, YouTubers? It's your boy Tekiwaga here with the uh, Android 6.0 Marshmallow um, talk. I'm going to talk about um, what a lot of people might be very interested in is how does app permissions work. So um, basically, you go to go ahead and go to your settings, and you're going to find apps because that's what's asking for all the permissions apps. And these are all your apps. Well, everything you got to install, these are all your apps. And all your apps, whatever it is, all your apps are right here in the app section. Now, you see the setting icon, you click on that again. And then this is how you configure um, how you want your applications to work and run. So, the very first one is apps permission. So, you're going to go there and go to apps permission. And then, um, it's going to categorize based on calendar, uh, camera, contacts, SMS, all that. So um, you just pick which ones you don't want the apps to get permission from, and then um, you either turn it on or turn it off. And sometimes you'll get this message saying that if you deny this permission, uh, basic features of your device may no longer function as intended. So you either cancel or you deny. So, or you could turn like like I said, Chrome. You could turn on, turn off. You don't want Chrome to be using your camera or your Google Drive. You could turn on, turn off. Um, Google App, turn on, turn off. Um, so that that's how apps permission works. And sometimes you will get into an actual application, and it will like notify you do you want this app to allow or deny so you either allow it or deny it and um, like sometimes you'll get a message uh, in messenger or let me see if uh, yeah sometimes you'll, you'll get a, a permission from uh, WhatsApp depending on what the situation is if you're trying to get camera see it says ca camera cannot start because I turned it off so in this application so when you get that message um, that means that the camera cannot be used um, for video or imaging or anything like that so also see it says uh, push bullet permissions needed uh, for SMS zinc in for context so you could turn on and turn off um, any permission for any application with Android 6.0 Marshmallow. Now, for some, you might not be able to get these functions right away, but there are, there are other um, alternatives on the Google Play Store. You just have to, you know, um, experiment with these third-party apps. But Google is allowing you to basically turn on and turn off permissions now, and um, that can actually help developers as well. So this is my talk on apps permission of uh, Android 6.0 Marshmallow. Um, I got the Nexus 6. I didn't upgrade to 6P or 5X yet because I knew I was getting 6.0 on Nexus 6. But let me know your thoughts about Android 6.0 Marshmallow so far, guys. If you're on it, um, how do you like the setup? How you like the new settings? Um, I like the, the UI uh, tuner because I, I can adjust all that so I don't have to root for that or things in that sort. And I do uh, play with uh, launches and icon packs now. So. Alright, it's your boy. I'll take you all, guy. Peace.